हेलो स्टूडेंट्स दिस इज अरवीना अली फैकल्टी ऑफ माउंट लिट्रा जी स्कूल झांसी चिल्ड्रन एज यू कैन सी इन द पिक्चर दिस इज योर इंग्लिश ग्रामर टेक्स्ट बुक एंड आई एम गोइंग टू एक्सप्लेन यू चैप्टर नंबर टू सिंगल एंड प्लूरल नाउंस children now singular noun is a person place animal or thing which is one but plural noun are person place animal or thing which is more than one or you can say are many children now let's see an example of singular and plural one lemon singular many lemons plural one watch singular many watches plural one flower singular many flowers plural one finger singular many fingers plural now children here are some rules to change a singular noun into a plural noun rule number 1 most of the singular noun we add s to make them plural children as you can see in the picture one dog is called as dog because it is a singular but when we are going to change into a plural we'll add s and it will be called as dogs one dog two dogs now next is now children singular noun which ends with s x z c h and s h when we are going to change them into a plural we are going to as add es children let's see an example spelling of bench ends with ch when we are going to change into a plural form we are going to add only es because the spellings ends with ch we'll add es to make it a plural form so bench will be benches one bench two benches one more example dish children spelling of dish ends with sh so we are going to add es in the last to make it a plural noun one dish two dishes now children the nouns that ends in y and has a vowel before it we will add s in the word to make it a plural noun children as you know vowels are a e i o u let's see an example and then you are going to understand it more properly turkey children spelling of turkey ends with a y and before y is e and e is a vowel so when we are going to change turkey into a plural we'll add s because it has a vowel before a y so no changes only add s at the end of the spelling to make it a plural one turkey two turkeys now next is the nouns that ends in y with a consonant before the y change the y to i and add es children consonant are letters except a e i o u whatever whatever letters are left are consonant so children now in this rule what we have to do is if a consonant is given before a y so we are going to remove y 
and add i in place of y and we'll write es at the last so let's say an example puppy will be puppies as you can see children i have removed y and placed i and add es at the last to make it a plural so it will be puppies now children some of the nouns which ends with f or fe we are going to remove only f and fe and add ves to make it a plural noun for example knife children spelling of knife ends with fe so when we are going to make it a plural we will remove fe and add ves so it will be knives now children most of the nouns that ends in consonant plus o as you can see an example i have given mango children before a o is a consonant so we are going to add es at the last to make it a plural so mango will be mangoes one mango two mangoes now children most of the noun that ends in vowel plus o so children as we know vowels are a e i o u so if a singular noun ends with a o before and has a vowel before o we are going to add s to make it a plural noun so radio will be radios one radio two radios three radios now children singular noun can be formed by changing vowels in the singular noun children if we change only the vowel in the singular noun we can make it a plural noun for example men men foot will be feet now children some noun do not change at all when they are in plural form they never change they are always same in singular and the plural form sheep will be sheep fish will be fish now children some plural noun are completely different from singular noun the spelling is completely different as you can see in singular noun mouse will be called as mouse but in the plural form it will be called as mice that means many mice now children some nouns have only plural form and they are never used as singular noun for example clothes children we never say cloth it is always said clothes let's see an example i am wearing cloth so it will be wrong we will always use a term clothes i am wearing clothes now children see example number 2 scissors then stairs children now this is an exercise number 1 where you have to change a singular noun into a plural noun as exercise number 2 3 and 4 is given in your pdf so kindly do the exercises in the notebook by seeing the rules and examples i have explained to you in the video children number 1 is butterfly children as you can see spelling of butterfly ends with a y and before a y is l and l is a consonant so we are going to remove y and add ies to make it a plural form butterfly will be butterflies now c number 2 that is puppy children here also the spelling ends with y 
but before y p is given and p is a consonant so here also we are going to remove y and add i e s to make it a plural form puppy will be puppies now number 3 is loof now in loof as you can see the spelling ends with f so over here we are going to remove f and add v e s to make it a plural form it will be loofs now number 4 mango children as you can see before a o a consonant is given so we are going to add es at the last to make it a plural form so it will be mangoes now number 5 is thief children here also the spelling ends with f so we are going to remove f and we let ves to make it a plural form it will be thieves